So I made a video on this cute little chuck, six inch four jaw, and made a face plate for it, which fits perfect. My hands are dirty. So, like so, huh? Iron dust. Mm. So this little lathe behind me worked perfect. So it gets a chuck tomorrow after I clean it up. So it's time to almost to go. I had a lot of fun doing that. I was doing other things too, but it's still nothing like. I'm not goofy. I always look goofy. Oh, that being said, what else can I say? I don't know. Oh, ball lightning fascinates me and bead lightning. Bead lightning is fun to try and make it, you know? What I did, I had these plasma capacitors. Oh yeah, uh, 5,000 joules. 25,000 volts. These 100 pounders could hold. How many MFD, oh, I forget. I, I have it written down here. So I put them in a series in parallel and put up 50,000, 200,000 volts, direct current DC. X-ray transformer Siemens. The spark gap was two tungsten rods. And they explode wires and things on those two tungsten rods. Where sometimes I get lucky and got a peep bead. Like that, come on. And I made a guidance system for the bead lightning when it shot off would go down this tube. I had uh what the heck? Corona rings around the tube with electrostatic accumulating on them. And it did work. But roughly every 60 seconds, bang! I've seen in some of those, those videos. <sighs> but that's Bob Greener and his project. Bagels and Oh, yeah, so I was, I was out in the sun today. So why did I look like a dog? Mm, must be this light. I'll be doing bead lightning again. Started when I was a kid with uh, two carbon arcs, the carbon rods. What the hell? Here we go again, siren. I didn't do anything wrong, did I? <laughs> Can you say nut? Bolt? Dirty, I'm gonna clean my hands on a dirty mess. Machining and building things every all the time. <laughs> Is that really John Hutchison? My god, what did the government do to him? I get those comments now because I do these videos. I think the government messed my head up and made me into what I'm doing now. <laughs> People are so damn ignorant and stupid, you know. I never did anything. It actually helped out a lot with these crazy things I'm doing. Deplorable nonsense. I see all these little videos and things on the internet say, John used to do this and the government nailed him. The government stole his 
lab and all this stupid crap. Talk about a bunch of screwed up, messed up people. And then you get Mr. Smith, another dingbat, who said I used a, a string with my UFO. Talk about dingy, stupid. <laughs> People are so stupid you just don't want to bother with them. Most people, I, I really don't like humans that much. I like certain humans, yes, but not Joe Average and those dingbats. I get along fine with everybody, professional, even Okay, I even had the U.S. congressman show up in my place. We went out for lunch. Yes, Berkeley Bedell, Dennis Kucinich, to name a couple, and I met other heads of state from Liechtenstein and other places. Come on, in Japan as well, in Germany. Prince Schwarzenberg. Schwarzenberg Palace. I get along with a lot of people. I get along with more refined people and dingbats. Goofy people. I want to get along with hobbits. The hobbits rule. Come on. They do this stuff now. Like Charles Crawford III and alien <coughs> scientists and all chemist tech guys. All those cool new kids on the block. Ron. Awesome stuff Ron doing. Older gentleman, but he's still a hobbit. So a lot of older hobbits. <coughs> I do believe I got a cold. It could be <coughs> the sniffles, but who cares? I'm handling it okay. <coughs> Get coughing and sneezing and runny nose and <coughs> like that kind of stuff. <coughs> I've had it for a number of days now. I can feel it coming and going. <coughs> I take vitamins and my friend John Hughes sent over stuff from China used for tr treating certain viruses in China. <coughs> but I use it too. If I go go on a sneezing fit while I'm talking on this stupid iPad, <coughs> I don't know. That starts with that and then sneezing and snorting and Oh, well. Anything else new in my world? No, I don't know. Uh, nothing much. That's what I'm doing here now today. See the lights from there? I think you can. So. You know, I'm going to move this up a bit. So, this is how I start up this lathe. It's hilarious, actually. Uh, see, I'm recording, okay. I have to drive mechanism up in the air there, so here we go. See that, okay? Cool, 
girdles are cool. Cool, good.